Hello and welcome to another episode of Limo Life. Woo! T today we're gonna install a floor. Is that really necessary? I don't think it's very necessary. No, I think. Are you, how are you standing there even? Ah, oh, that's one. That's a nice looking floor right it, there. It, I'll tell you it, what, it is. That's just for the trailer, right? We're gonna leave that there. <laughs> nope. Fuck. Oh boy. That's some heavy wood. <laughs> I feel like most of the weight in this is just water. Oh yeah. Kind of like me, just water weight. Well, yeah, it's just water weight. And drop. Yeah, good. <laughs> we have acquired this nice piece of sheet metal that I'm going to attempt to cut out all of that and replace it with this. Wow. Do so I need the death wheel? Oh God. Everybody's favorite. Well, uh, you do the death wheel. I'm gonna go check on the dog. Okay, yeah. you. For like that. for like two hours. Check on the dog for that I'll doesn't go, take I'll that long. You're all out of time, boys. Our merch drop ends in just a few hours. This is your final chance to pick you up some thick boy summer swimming trunks and matching beach shirt or anything else on odsmerch.com and have a chance to win this 2020 KTM 690 worth ten thousand dollars. So don't don't miss out. If you want to help support the next big project on the channel after the limo and, and try. Trust me, you're 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 gonna want to see it. Then buying the merch is the best way to do it. So so hurry up before it's all gone or don't. I guess I don't really care. I love you. Uh, enjoy the video. Goodbye. Mwah. I am no longer human. I am a robot sent from the future to demolish this floor. I had a thought. There's a gas line around here somewhere. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's it right there. I need to avoid that. I mean, there's almost like nothing fucking left of this part. Fuck yeah. Here, here we go. Woo! There we go. Now we got a nice, Shit, son. nice access hole. Yeah. That was a lot of cutting. That was. There's still a good amount of metal there. Yeah. Never done this before. I don't know if you can tell. I'm not exactly an expert at this, but... I could just leave the hole like that, you know? I don't think I'm gonna be able to... I'm not talented enough. So we'll just pretend. Hey, we did it. <laughs> just how they used to build cars back in the day. Yep. Just a couple of men. <laughs> it's getting worse the more I try and it's, uh, uh, bend a little, it. A little bent. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I thought it would just kind of go in there. And... They do it all the time on the hot rod shows. I tried patching this shit for a while with uh, no success. So we're just gonna leave it for now. Don't worry, I'll come back later and, and fix her right up. You'll, you'll see that in, in the next episode. But for now, I'm fucking done with this. Yeah, we'll be covering it up. We're putting a whole new floor in here. At least we cut all the rust out. So the broom didn't like being worked at that angle. Uh, you break the I fucking broke the broom. Oh. This video is brought to you by Raycon! Raycon's new everyday earbuds look, feel, and sound better than ever. With optimized gel tips for the perfect in-ear fit, these earbuds are so comfortable and they will not budge. Trust me. Still there! Plus, they offer eight hours of playtime and a 32-hour battery life. That's like a long time. Real, real, that's longer than a day. And the best part is, Raycons are priced just right. You get quality audio at half the price of other premium audio brands. I mean, it's no wonder that Raycons Everyday Earbuds have over 50,000 five-star reviews. One of my favorite features is the three customizable sound profiles. So if I'm listening to some, some mad bass, I, I can turn up the bass. Or if I'm listening to something else and I don't want to hear this much bass, different sound profile. Also, the noise isolation on these things is just insane. I can mow the yard and I can't even hear the lawnmower. It's kind of a problem because sometimes it'll just turn off and I'll finish mowing and then I look and then <laughs> So if you want to get your grubby little hands on a pair of these wireless everyday earbuds, then go to buyraycon.com slash ODS and you can get 15% off of your order. So for the wood flooring, we've got these little metal covers that they go on, uh, on top of here. So I'm just gonna mount like a two by four to the top of it. So we can we can put the yeah the flooring yeah. will go in. Supports. I'll have a 3D animation to show you exactly what I mean. Will you? Yeah. Will you though? Maybe 2D. That's the first metal colored metal I've seen in this car in a little while. Yeah, well, just the top. Why are we doing this? Uh, I don't know. Right. Remember, I'll always measure. Seven. I'll do 76 inches. A big board, eh? Oh boy. Prepare to die. Hey, what do they call these Sharpies when they're honestly like pretty dull? They're pretty dull. Like I've tried to kill someone with it. Really? Can I get a hiya? I don't 
That'll go right to y'all. It's as tall as you are. It is. Look at the little guy. <laughs> now that those are cut, I'm going to use a drill bit and I'm gonna drill and screw it in. And then we can screw the floor into these and these will be securely attached to the car. Securely. Just so make sure we don't need to get under that panel once the flooring is attached. Kind, kind of attached. Sort of attached. In the car. How, can you really even be inside the car anymore now that it's got so many holes in it? Ugh. That's like the straw question, right? How many <laughs> holes are in a straw? Yeah, how many holes can be in this car before it's not a car? And <laughs> yeah, this hole's pretty convenient. I can almost stand up in here. Hey, look at that. Yeah. Oh, it could be the fishing hole. Hey. Pull over an ice lake, drill yeah. a hole in, you can fish from inside. Where All right. The fuck does a lake <laughs> ice around here? I got the uh, Steve Irwin brand uh, drill bits. Crocky. It says dry wall screw. It's gonna be a dry floor. Is it though? It's gonna be a floor. <laughs> Look, as long as you don't take her out on rainy days, it'll be a dry floor. I'm not gonna take this thing out on any days. You know, Reese, I, I didn't think it would work out at first, but I'm really digging the fallout aesthetic in the car. It wasn't intentional. Oh, it's shit. It's supposed to be luxurious. Uh, there's no rhyme or reason on where I'm gonna put these drill holes. I'm just gonna kind of pull that bitch down. Holding her. You ain't going nowhere, bitch. Hey, why are you so aggressive? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just holding her down. Ah! Yeah, drill it! God damn it! Drill it! Strong. God damn it. Woo! Looks good. All right. If I hear one more word from this cameraman, <laughs> will drywall screws work on wet floors? Perfectly. <laughs> the cloud of rust. This is both low effort and effective. Yeah, well, sure. Is this our first modification? I think so. Official, like adding something to the. I think it's the All first right. modification. Oh, dude, crack up. Tires is a repair. Those are routine maintenance maintenance. repairs. This is yeah. a modification. That's not a modification. Uh, that this LP? side goes on this side. Okay. That side goes on. Perfect. It's almost like it's meant Holy to go Holy shit, in. yeah, that's, that is damn perfect. Kind of hard to get in place, but you know. We're in. That teeny tiny screw is the only one holding this in. But be fine. we'll have a lot of weight pushing down yeah. on it. So like, it's not like that really yeah. is going to come up. Secure. Are these the same height as this hump? If it is, it's gonna make our life way easier. It already is not. Oh no. So basically we need a whole other two by four. Just running down the middle? I'm running down the middle. Okay, that's what it looks like. Do you think we could set the two by four on it and then drill? Yeah, give me another two by four. Let's see if that'll even be. Cause I think it'll be uneven in the opposite direction. I mean, I could have just gotten a thinner board for on top of this. Not bad, but I mean, honestly that would be acceptable. Actually, we could do like bed slats. Yeah. It'd be a little more work, but I think it would definitely be more secure. We need a bunch of boards that are ex basically exactly as wide as this. I love doing a job and then undoing the job and then having to do it again. I, I wouldn't say it's my fault. Technically it happened because of me, but it's not. I wouldn't I wouldn't put the fault on me. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go as far to say my fault. I've been working on the limo way too fucking long. Tiny little gap in the middle. Hey, someone say that's fucking you. <laughs> Some would say that's con uh, conservation of materials. Boom, shakalaka. <laughs> Ain't going nowhere. When it makes that <laughs> sound, that's when you know it's good. Oh, I gotta do this side now. Oh boy. Yep, looks good. Feels good. We're making progress in here, Tyler. All right. Once we get this floor in, it's really gonna start to take shape, I feel like. It'll be a nice blank slate. Where you can really start to imagine how beautiful this thing's gonna be. On the inside, not on the outside. It's all about inner beauty. Ah, that's what we should've named it, inner beauty. Inner beauty. I like the Rust Taco more. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's, that's on there. So we got all these little, little beams put across. Oh, let go. That's gonna be sturdy. Hell yeah. God damn, we're such men right now. Ah, thank you, man. Oh, you're you're welcome, man. Oh, yeah, you could do some hardcore activities on here. Not fucking. Can't fucking here. No fucking allowed in the limo. Thanks, man. Oh, uh, no, no problem, human. You done yet? What? Are you done yet? What? Are you done yet? Delivery. I actually really probably only need four. Yeah. So we'll save that one for All something right. else. I'll glue it back together. <laughs> we almost have a floor in here. Here we thought we were done ripping out all the carpet. No sir, time for a mildew adventure. Godspeed with that one. Hey, that is like really clean. Yeah. There's the smell. Why is the one area that was literally filled with water right the there. only spot in this car that has zero rust? What the fuck? Oh, dude, you can pump some tunes. There's an aux cable back here. Oh, hell yeah. Your phone does have an aux port, right? No. Shit. Yeah, ripping this out was surprisingly painless. I'm just uh, kind of eyeballing where these um, support boards go, beams, because they're not gonna, you're not gonna see them. So, you know, as long as they work. As long as they're supporting, they work. 
Oh, 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 that's dirty. We're moving right along in here, Tyler. Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh yeah, look that at is. that. Walk on that. Oh, yeah, not even budging. Yeah. That's, I trust that with my life. I don't I don't hold my life in high regard, yeah. so. I really am enjoying screwing my wood. I don't know about you guys. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do the floor in that area. I'll figure it out. It should be uh, interesting, to say the least. Woo! Done. Let go. That's a whole ass floor. And Google what a twin size mattress is. 75. Hey, perfect. 38 by right here. 38 by 75. So yeah, we'll just build this part of the floor to where that ends. I'll cover up the hole. Nah, just Next leave it. Next time. We could just, have a little hatch here. You yeah. open up as if you uh, just so happened to get in the hit 90s film speed and you need a way to escape through the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> it probably wouldn't work nearly as well on this car. The probably. ride height on a limo is a lot lower little, than little, a bus. A little bit. Uh, yeah, let's start cutting, ripping some boards. Woo! The nice and lightweight ones out there too. Man, what a nice flooring this is. Oh. What is this, mahogany? Oh my god, I think this is it's fucking uh, concrete. I believe the it's um, cheapest wood at Home Depot. Uh, there we go. Uh, I sure wish someone would hurry up and win this damn thing. Uh, OESmerch.com. All right, flip the switch. Uh, like butter, more. Little bit. We did it. In she goes. Now, now, now we gotta, we gotta measure, we gotta cut it this way. Uh, all right. Oh, push, push, woo! We did it. Now it should fit pretty easily. Like a dream. That side, yeah. Oh, it's coming together. Oh yeah, it's looking like a house. Look at that. That's a floor. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I could sleep here all day long. <laughs> I know about the hole, Kevin. <laughs> there was a little bit of rust, and I had a brilliant idea to try and cut the rust out and re-weld a patch panel in, but... Welding? I can do that. It's not the welding that's the problem. It's the shaping of the metal. I have a hammer. We had a hammer, too. It didn't work. Now it kind of creates a home for wildlife. They come in from under the car, <laughs> and then they can live in the car with us. Yeah. Uh, turn the table, table saw again. <laughs> it needs to be on. Oh! That's, that was already broke, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, no, it actually was. There we go. Yeah. Come on. Woo. Into the rust hole I go. The only one who has their tetanus shot is Joey. He's the only one not getting in the car. Some would call Joey the smartest. Yeah. Oh, fuck. How far off are we? Oh, wait. Yeah, yeah. It'll, there we go. There we go. Perfect. Fuck yeah. Look at that. That's an entire fucking floor. Look at all this room for activities. Oh my God. So, much so room. many activities. You can just run around and just do so many things. It's Woo. like, man, this is crazy. It's just my hot oh, oh my God. This is so much fun. So much room. Do we even have to put a bed in here? There's this so much a, room. This is amazing. This is, oh, bunk beds. Bunk beds. We have so much. Let's go ask mom and dad. <laughs> All right, so the limo is eventually going to need some electrical work done. We're going to need lights, air conditioning, all that good stuff hooked up. So we need an electrician. <laughs> Got an electrician, kind of, sort of. Let me let me walk you through everything we need done on this bad boy. Why do you have a bottle of chicken cock? It's every electrician's well, medicine. Currently, we don't have the new ceiling in, but once we do, we're going to have uh, little, little puck lights. We're going to need wiring for all of the lights, the like, little um, tiny LED puck lights. Like hockey? Are you sure he's an electrician? Lights for that. And um, phone chargers, mini phone Ooh, chargers. Mini we need uh, chargers. USB okay. ports everywhere. It's gonna be a TV right here that's gonna swivel out. Air conditioning, we gotta figure out air conditioning. I know what your problem is. Huh? It ain't got no gas in this, it. He's not an electrician. <laughs> we need to rip all this out. I think I have decided oh, yeah. I'm going to build a whole new ceiling for this. So I think we need to rip. God, <laughs> shake it about. I lost, we, lost, we lost the mirror. Oh my God, we're gonna have to sweep. Oh my God. Can't breathe the rust. I don't think that's rust. I think, I think that's asbestos. We don't have health insurance, by the way. No, oh, I know. Okay. Is there an equal amount of rust on the ceiling as there is? I the think fucking... so. It looks brown when I was pulling it down. It's actually not as bad as I thought. I got my tan in. <laughs> that's a spray tan. <laughs> the sunroof, I would like just gone. Yeah, but it takes up a lot of headspace right here. So I'm gonna do an arch ceiling. You got dust on my chicken cock. Next time on Limo Life. I tried to scrape the rust off last time. It didn't work, so I'm just going to power through it. We'll make sure this is flat. Not warped at all. I love Home Depot wood. It's fantastic wood. I'm pretty sure you could kickflip this. Ah!